<clears throat> hey guys, it's Detective Fallen here, back with another investigation video of Yakuza Zero. Um, last time we left off, I had just completed the first part of Mission Two, uh, or Chapter Two, sorry, and then I forgot to save it. I didn't realize this was a game that did not have auto saves in between and that really messed me up <laughs> so I had to go back and do all the stuff that I did before but in the process we did stop by a couple more different places um, I got frustrated couldn't find the sake myself again so I went looking around the hotel district enough Alright, so the last time we left off, we'd just seen Botches, I think is his name. Um, <clears throat> and we were supposed to meet him back here. <laughs> were you on your way somewhere, boy? Sorry to hold you up. Uh. Yeah, you wanted to talk? That's right, tell me, have you been training? Yeah, here and there. Good, because I have something I'd like to ask you to do if you're willing. Mm. That is. What's with the hesitation? That's not like you. Ah. Truth is, I've got debt collectors on my tail. Scary mm. ones. Yeah, I've gathered. You've been running since we met. No, no, no. Those two bit jokers are nickel and dime stuff. I'm talking tunas. Tunas. Famous, and I mean that in a global sense. And now they're here in Japan, hot on my tail. Hold on. Did you seriously try to escape your mountain of debt by fleeing to Japan? <laughs> Yes, and this time there may be no going back. I think there's a price on my head. So I guess it's too late to pay the money back then. What are we going what are you going to do, botches? Well, I was hoping I could get you to be my bodyguard. I figured as much. Unfortunately I've already got enough trouble on my plate. Believe me, you'd probably be in worse danger with me around. Oh uh, no. That's that's no way to have a heart, please. Sure, I can't pay a retainer. But if you protect me, I'll teach you some of my top shelf moves. Shelf moves. That good enough? That good stuff. Are these moves better than your credit? Yeah. Damn straight they are. They'll do the they'll do you right in a tight Oh my god. They'll do you right in a tight fight, my boy. <laughs> are you botches? I think they found me, boy. This is a big scary debt collector, huh? I'm here for your head. Just doing my job, so don't hold it against Nani. me. Debt collector, huh? More like Hitman. No, no. I don't want to die. Please help me, boy. Tch. Guess I have... Don't have much of a choice. If I let you... If I left you here, it'd be like putting a bullet in your head myself. You stand back. Thanks, boy. You're protecting this guy? For now. I don't especially feel like watching him die. I see. Fine. There may not be a price on your head, but I'll see if I can swing a bonus hey. afterwards. Watch out, boy. I don't like the look of this one. Way ahead of you, alright? Let's do this. Oh, he's got a gun. My man's got a gun. <laughs> Alright. Slap him on his head. Boom! And we're gonna pick him up again. And we're gonna slam him around some more. Boom! I'm gonna use this thing. And I'm gonna beat him to death with him. Oh crap. No, 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 no. <laughs> he shot me in my boot. Dang. He is getting me. Uh oh. Dare you shoot me? Took two bullets for this man. Boy. I'm letting you live. You go back and tell whoever ordered the hit to forget about botches. You hear me? <laughs> you think I'm the only one after this guy? What? There'll be others on his trail soon enough. He'll get what's coming to him. Ah. 
sorry boy. Why the apology? I told you to watch out for the knife and the ribs, yet here I am putting you in danger myself. Don't worry about that. I'd rather hear more about the offer you made earlier. Oh. What? Mm -hmm. You said you'd teach me some new moves. Better make it quick, though, before the next hitman gets here. You sure about this, boy? I don't have much choice. Like I said, I've got my own problem, so a few extra survival skills would come in handy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, then let me fill you in on some moves that'll send those hitmen reeling. Alright, show me. You owe me a good one. Bye. You ready to learn some moves? Yeah. These are the moves that I can teach you, boy. What's the key to brawling? How do I break down defenses? Mm. How do I break down defenses? Or what's the key to brawling? We'll go with how do I break down defenses today. Opponents that stay on the defense are a real hassle. Sometimes that right move in boxing matches to bide your time and wait for a win by decision. But that's not the way of the true champion. You need the fighting instinct to do whatever it takes to grab the wrench down grab and wrench down the other guy. Fighting instinct, huh? Brawling and boxing don't have much in common, but I get what you're saying. This is the perfect move for opponents with a solid defense. I call it the face squeeze. You learned an essence of face twisting. I see. Your opponent can break free if you grab their arm or leg, but it isn't so easy when you're holding their face. Even with their guard up, you can have your way with them. Yeah. Yes, you're quick on the uptake, aren't you, boy? Your botches, huh? Oh, here's the next one. Another assassin. This looks, this one looks pretty beefy. Word is your bodyguard here knows how to handle himself. That's why I got called in. What? Why you professional killers like us always risk getting the tables turned on us. You often hear about a second rate hitman being taken out by their yes. target. Yes, and that's what happened to everyone sent after me so far. Although my boy here doesn't kill them. Well, that won't happen. That won't be happening with me. They call me the unassailable assassin. Nobody gets past my defenses, so I always get the job done. Here's your chance, boy. Uh. I get it. You want me to try out the move I just learned, right? Quit your mumbling. I haven't got all day, you know. Let's go. <clears throat> Slip past a guarding enemies arms grab their face twist them to the ground then stomp them to finish the job <laughs> press y in front of an enemy with a guard up
Ah, oh, this hitman is a little bit stronger. I'm gonna beat you with a brick, boy. Take the brick. Sorry, I'm beating this man with a bike. <laughs> He's gotta kill it. Big Kablooey. I don't get it. How'd you break past Boy. my defenses? What was that about second-rate hitmen getting taken out by their targets? You met your match today, so don't come back. I I won't. <clears throat> You're getting stronger every day, boy. Uh. Yeah, guess I have to thank you for that. Hey boy, you ready to learn some moves? Of course. These are the moves I can teach you, boy. What's the key to brawling? Yes. Okay. The, the most important thing in a fight is tenacity. That's the secret. Sounds pretty simple for a secret. Though, I guess in a fight, simplicity is best. Brawling comes down to the spirit in the end, so I'm going to teach you a move that harnesses that power. I call it Spirit Fire. You learn the extra res counter. Interesting. So you use the force of the enemy's blow to strike them back with twice yeah. the power. Yes, I'm sure you'll be able to make use of it. Your botch is right. <clears throat> Speaking of which, <laughs> hey. hmm. it's one of those Japanese hooligans. You call yourself an assassin? You look about as pro as some sorry street punk. I don't really know what's going on here, but I just got paid a fortune up front by some guy. I get the rest once the job's done. Oh, so he's a street fighter on a freelance job. He doesn't look so tough. Shut it. I may not look like much, but I never lost a fight. Time to earn this cash. Think you have the tenacity to win? This is the perfect chance, uh. boy. Yeah. Time to try out that move I just learned. What? You want some f first, do you? Alright, open up. And I'll serve you your own teeth. <clears throat> can charge up a counter attack. The attack is more powerful and likely to knock the opponent down. Just hold down X. Oh, okay.
How the hell do you get the better of me? <laughs> the boy Good. wins. Hey, yeah? What did the guy who paid you look like? It was dark, so I didn't get a good look at their face. From the way they talked, I guess they were four. No. Well, it wasn't me. Of course not. It's the guy who's out to get you. Don't you go getting any big, more big ideals, okay? Yeah, I hear you. Oh! Hmm. I heard these were the most dangerous debt collectors around. Looks like you handled this one no problem, though. We better hope they're all like this, then. Hey, hey boy, you ready to learn some moves? Always. Oh, Sorry, boy. boy, there's nothing I can teach you yet. Oh. You haven't upgraded your abilities enough to learn new techniques from watches. Upgrade your brawler style. Abilities under abilities in the pause. <laughs> Curiosity, no one tells me where I can't go. Seems like they're in the middle of it. Oh, I can't go that way basically. Oh. <laughs> before we turn in we could also check out oh wait <coughs> oh here's the champion district the Tachibana real estate guys have apparently been coming here a lot lately it's worth a walk around to see okay I guess we weren't heading home <coughs> we are heading to follow up on these clues this is the bar where I met Kasuga the reporter investigator uh, Kamarucho's dark side. Oh, we could go ahead and take care of that. Uh, in case you guys don't know what's going on, um, there, I have another video where I met, I don't know if I uploaded it or not yet, uh, at this point, but it's, a uh, where I met this other officer, or not even an officer, I think he's just an undercover citizen, trying to come up with some stories so he can, you know, do the job he wants to do. <coughs> if Kasuga is here, I'll let him tell me one of his stories. Ah, oh, he's not here. Oh yeah, he is. Kasuga is here. Guess I'll say hello. Barkeep, whiskey and water. Hey. Yes, sir. Coming right up. Mm. Whiskey and water guy next to him. It's the gun dealer. To let him know you want a gun, you sit next to him and order a whiskey and water. That's how it went last mm. time. Kasuga must be making his moves right now. 
boss man stepping out for a bit. Are you a reporter? Mm -hmm. Huh? You're writing a dead give. Your writing's a dead giveaway. Besides, you've been snooping around for a while, sneaking glances yep. away. No, uh, I haven't. Shut your hole. We'll see if you sing a different tune, minus a few white and pearlies. Follow me. Now he's done it. I told him to stay out of it. Guess I can't ignore this. Guess we'll go ahead and make sure this guy doesn't wind up dead. Honestly, I'm not a reporter. Help! I'm sick of clowns like you. Got no choice but to make an example of you. So the next Joker doesn't. Uh, next Joker thinks Good. twice. That's enough. You were in the bar too. What's it to you? Here's my. He's my sworn brother. You mind backing off? What? <clears throat> sworn brother? Then he's not a reporter. Well, at least you're no civilian. <laughs> Fine. I'll take your word for it. If you can prove it with your fist. Aw, oh, this guy just pulled a fucking gun on me, though. Yeah, more trucker. Yeah, more trucker. <laughs> Who do you think you're pulling a gun on? I'll beat you with the barista sign. How about that? Fist don't lie. <clears throat> Satisfied? You'll back off now. Fair enough. A deal's a deal. Seriously? Then listen about that gun. Sell me a firearm. Oh. Hey, Kasuga. <laughs> you got nerve. I like that. I usually don't deal with first timers, but I'll make an exception this time. <laughs> yes, score. You saved me back there. Thanks, man. Go on now. Drink up. It's on me. Kasuga, you got balls getting the deal done after that hairy start. That's some nerve. <laughs> but that's the least of what it takes to chase down what my readers want. Thanks to you, I got a killer story. How about up in arms, a frightening first-hand focus on the district's deadliest dealers. Sound exciting? Better hope our new friend doesn't read your story. Mm. Now, what to do with this little toy? know where I can dump it. Ready? What? After all the effort, you, you're you ditching the gun? Well, <laughs> sure. I mean, I'm a law-abiding citizen. All I need is the story. The pen is mightier than the gun. I honestly don't get what makes a journalist tick. Alright, how about a gift? I gift this to you as your reward. I get this feeling you're just dumping it on me, but okay, gratefully accepted. Thanks. <clears throat> you got a 9mm automatic pistol. Man, I got a gun? I got a... I got a pistol and a shotgun now well then <clears throat> what shall i write about next <clears throat> even after that skill scare still no lesson learned huh you know what you know i can't save your ass every time right <laughs> thanks for the warning but this is who i am once i catch wind of a new story there's no stopping me until it's told if another juicy article starts brewing i'll find you in the scoop uh, uh, i'll fill you in on the scoop over a couple drinks naturally <laughs> Ever the fearless reporter. Still, there's a lot even I don't know about the dark side of Kumarucho. Kumarucho is a scarier place than I imagined. So I am a bit like <clears throat> confused. Okay, so the sword is definitely better, but like. I just don't get, like, can I use the ammo? Because I know I'm not able to, like, pull out the katana in battle, as far as I've seen. <clears throat> Alright, let's go to the pink circle. <clears throat> I 
I'm supposed to check. Okay, there we go. Oh shit. <laughs> you lost friend? Why are you here? There's no place in this neighborhood. Oh god, let them talk. あんた、また登場会の若い衆か。いや、そうじゃない。あんたらの店を地上げしに来たわけでもない。よく言うな。だったら立花不動産に何の用だ。あの連中のことを知りたいだけだ。あんたらに迷惑はかけない。あ、ありかんげされてないようだな。俺らはもうヤクザにうんざりなんだよ。お前らは心の道を込みとしか思ってないんだろうが。The Oh, that was pretty smooth. That was pretty smooth. He threw his knife up and caught it like he was something. <clears throat> nope, I want this one. This is what I want. <clears throat> なんだこいつ。少しは話を聞く気になってくれたか。俺は。あの人たちを売る気はない。ここの住人ならだれだってそうだ。うん。連中もここで地上げしてるんじゃないのか。違う。あの人たちは。ヤクザの地上げから俺
カモロ町が戦争で焼ける前からいるような人たちのもんだしうちの社長が言うにはここらはカムロ町の根っこだ俺たちみてえな新参者に好き勝手する資格はないってささっきのビルの時とは随分態度が違うんだな白亜ビル<笑>あそこの連中は所詮流れ物の寄せ集めだあんたもスナック生瀬の店長を見たろさも肩たの被害者ですって面してたがよあいつらだってよそから流れてきた時元いた住人を追い出してんだから因果応報ってやつだよま俺は社長のポリシーに従ってるだけでね偉そうに言うつもりはないけどそれでもあんたらにはあんたらなりのルールがあるってわけだ俺はおだってもんだ立花社長とは古くてな大抵の現場は俺が仕切ってるであんた結局どうするんだうちの社長に会いに行くのかああ会ってもう一度話を聞かせてもらうどうやら立花不動産ってのは思っていた以上に腹の底が見えねえ会社なんだな Alright, so there's some mystery behind these guys <clears throat> They're not like They got morals, is what they're basically saying, but <clears throat> I don't know. They all just seem like a bunch of gangsters. <laughs> oh shit. I'm about to be going fast. Once, I, once we do some of that uh, go kart stuff. Need to go back there. There's a couple things we need to go do around town. We can go bowling too. Pretty shifty. Somewhere. Yeah, it's this building. Oh, here we go. That Oda guy said if I want in the penthouse, here's、uh, Tabachu will show up. Anything I'm forgetting before I head up. Well, let's go ahead and head inside. <clears throat> I'm good. Let's go. I mean, I'm sure I'll still be able to go bowling. I'm sure I'll still be able to go to the you know, little race cars and stuff. Even after this. <clears throat> we'll have plenty of time in the next chapter. <laughs> the next chapter will probably be like another four hours long. I'm going to be the one who's been here. I'm going to be the one who's been here. I'm going to be the one who's been here. 後で来ることになってるはずだ部屋で待ってろと言われた<笑>それは何かの間違いじゃないですか何うちのおだってもんから連絡が入ってましてね若いチンピラが来るだろうから
死なない程度に可愛がってやれと。なんだ。織田が。おれ、回れ右すんなら今のうちだ。おとなしく帰んなら見逃してやるよ。は<笑>、スクリューダーノイズ。てめえ、聞こえなかったのか。さっさと帰れっつってんだろうが。おら、ここのとこ、どこ行っても歓迎されやしね。呼ばれた先で門前払いとは苔にされたもんだだから誰も呼んでねえっつってんだバカ野郎どげお前らじゃ話になんのガキが土地狂いやがってどうなっても知らねえぞお前はオーダー。お前が俺を襲うようにさっきの連中をけしかけたんだなんでだあんただって俺たちを死なさぬにしてたろならこっちにもその権利があるんじゃねえかと思ってさま腕っぷしはそれなりみたいだけどあの立場の社長がわざわざスカウトするほどかと言われるどうもね部下に襲わせるだけで俺の何がわかんだだからさやっぱ自分でやるしかないみたいだよいやー仕事を人に任せられないってのはしんどいね河村町で不動産やってるとあらごとも多くてさ俺そこらの極道よりよっぽど血の気が多いんだよねただのサラリーマンとは違うと言いたいわけか大したもんじゃない元極道の半端者といい勝負だだったらお互い手加減はいらねえなそのつもりでかかってこいマシェッはい。
think you're a match for my monster style. <laughs> There's nothing he can do about it, I don't think. Oh, okay, there we go. <clears throat> On your head, sir. go. <clears throat> tightened up a little bit at the end there. I was whooping his ass in the beginning. Didn't expect him <laughs> to start pulling out some moves. しましたか。小田さん。ええ。俺の。負けですよ、社長。どうなってる。あんたも承知で小田に俺を試させたってことなんか。小田さんは私にとって掛けがえのない片腕ですだから我々の中にあなたを迎え入れるには彼の業界を取る必要がありましたそうかよ俺はつくづく自分がバカに思えてきたぜさっきまであんたらは信用してもいいって気になる立花そろそろ腹の中に隠してるもん見せろあんたはなぜこの俺に近づいてきたその理由は何なんだいいでしょうですがその前にあなたはこのカムロ町という町を何と見ますかカムロ町さあな<笑> 質問の意味がわかんねえ。私はね、キリュウさん。この町は道島組をはじめとする東場会の餌場であると見ています。一晩中ネオンに彩られたこの町に集まる人や金。そこから溢れる甘い汁は全て東場会の極道たちに吸い
金は力私は自分の力がこの先どこまで登場界に迫れるか試してみたいですがまだまだでしてねの今の私ではせいぜい10秒というところが限界ですがいずれは空の一粒を手に入れてカムロ町の支配者層に食い込むつもりですあの土地はそれだけの価値を生みますあんたは一体桐生さんがご存知かどうか登場会という組織は決して一枚岩ではありませんその証拠に登場会にはこの私に協力するある一人の人物がいますそして私があなたに近づいた理由はその人物から強力な推薦を受けたからなんですよ登場会の内通者ってことか誰なんだそいつはあなたと私が手を結ぶことを望んだその人物は登場会直系堂島組若頭風間慎太郎ですな,なんだとおやっさんが<笑>あなたは堂島組の若頭補佐久世さんから風間さんをスパイするように言われましたね風間さんの隠し持つ空の一坪の情報を探れと風間さんが隠し持っていた情報それは空の一坪の所有者を見つけ出すことのできる人間つまり私のことですあんたが我々は空の一坪をめぐる争奪戦であの堂島組より大きく先へ進んでいるいずれそのことを知れば彼らは激怒するでしょう本気で潰しにかかってくるはずですがそれを承知であなたが我々と手を結ぶことを他ならぬ風間さんが望んだ私が風間さんからあなたのことを託されたのは半年前あの人が刑務所に入るよりも前のことです風間さんはクゼがあなたに近づくこともあなたが組にいられなくなることもほぼ見通していましたまさかいくらおやさんでもそんなことまでわかるわけないだろう風間さんは堂島組どころか登場会という組織で頂点へ上り詰めるだけの気量を持った人間ですその懐はあまりに深い風間さんにとってあなたの周りに起こることを予測するのはたやすいはずですそしてその風間さんが空の一つを手に入れる目的はおそらく自分の身を守るなどということじゃないあの人はもっと大きなもののために絵を描いてるはずですだったらなんで今おやさんは無所に入ってるんだそれすらも風間さんの計画のうちではないかと私はそう信じています何だとバカなご理解いただけましたか桐生さん立花あんたがおやっさんの意思を託された人間だって証拠はあるのか風間さんがおっしゃるにはこれがその証拠になると。こ,これはあなたも見覚えがあるはずです。風間さんが沢村由美さんからプレゼントされたものだそうですね。おやっさんが。
あんたにこれを渡したのかあなたにお渡しするよう預かっていただけですあなたから風間さんにお返しくださいすべてが片付いた後で俺にはまだ親さんって人がどういう男なのかまるで分かっちゃいなかったってことかだがあの人が俺に何かを望むなら俺はいつでもそのために命張る覚悟だあの日おやっさんに逆らって極道になった時からそう決めていた。ではこれからどうぞよろしくお願いします。キリュウさん。All right, guys, that's going to wrap up chapter two the real estate broker in the shadows. Completion bonus, we got three million yen. <clears throat>、um, so, what we just figured out is Kazuya Kazama,、uh, the, the, the guy Kiryu follows, like basically looks up to as a dad and a mentor,、uh, was actually the one behind、uh, him wanting to meet. He wanted the, these two to get together basically so they could、uh, do what he needed them to do. So he could. We're unsure of his actual intentions, but he too wants to have possession of the lot. And he's still pulling strings even while he's in prison. So that's kind of cool.、Um, let's go ahead and see where this goes. See if we can go ahead and save it real quick.、Uh, I think it already saved it up. Get a little bit of a spoiler here, I guess. Climax Battles, I must open. See. Oh, there we go.、Let's、save right there. Alright, yeah. So, chapter three is going to be a gilded cage.、Uh, so, you get to see a little bit of that real quick right before I cut you guys off. But if you guys like this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and I will start right back from here. We'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. And, yeah. See you guys later.